What's up guys? Big D Wiz, old school stereo.com. Here we have the audio art 2400HO on the test bench. Now some of you may have seen my last video where I showed this jewel being unboxed. An amazing condition, almost brand new condition. Just a couple little nicks here and there. So what I'm gonna do now, I've got it hooked up to the DD-1 and the Valaymon Oscope. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna test the power output at four ohm stereo, four ohms bridged, and two ohm stereo. See what she'll put out. So hang on to your hats, here we go. And now on to the connections of the AudioArt 2400HO. As you can see on this side, we have RCA jacks, and I explain this further in here in just a minute about uh, what these are all about. We have a frequency for your crossover, uh, gain and frequency for the base EQ, and bridge on and off. And you might say, well, what about the gain for each channel? Well, as you can see, AudioArt has it nicely hidden right down here. Reminds me of the old Soundstream apps. They kind of did the same thing. And making our way to the other side, we have the four speaker terminals for right and left, plus and minus. We have a 30 amp fuse, and then we have the 12 volt ground and remote connection. All right, real quick before we get started, I wanted to dispel some of the myths here about how in the world does this joker work? Why does it have so many RCA jacks here? Well, what happens is you put your source from your head unit or your EQ or whatever you have last in the chain of the line before you get to your amp goes into the input here on the far left side then you choose uh, high or low and you actually jump those over to this side so in this case I was using the low output I was testing at uh, 40 Hertz so you just jump from here to here with the you know, just a standard RCA cable and alternatively if you wanted high pass you would go from high pass here over to the input there so there you go all right one other thing i wanted to show you real quick before we get started is the guts of the audio art 2400 ho as you can see very nice it's a little bit of wasted space here but those are gold 24 karat gold plated uh, traces there on the circuit board as you can see the daughter board here this is for the um, the crossover components and you can see there's some silt screening on the amp itself very nice there's a power supply a couple caps there Anyway, just wanted to show you the guts, the audio art, 2400HO. Let's fire this baby up with some test tones and see what she'll do. Here we go with a 4 ohm stereo test of the AudioArt 2400HO and we are using the 40 hertz test from the DD1 test disc and we're coming out low pass. I've got the uh, crossover turned all the way up so it's I think at 5 kilohertz down so I uh, shouldn't have any crossover bleed from that. So here we go. Let's test the output 4 ohms stereo. can see the uh, DD1 detecting the 40 hertz. And we're expecting around 100 watts. Oh, there's the light. Looks like the light is off at 105.6 watts. 105.6 watts per channel at 4 ohms. All 
All right, so here we have the two ohm stereo test, both channels loaded down with two ohms of resistors. Let's see what she'll do. 40 hertz test tone, 13.8 volts of input. One fifty six point one. Any higher than that, we get distortion. So we'll go with one fifty six point one. All right, so here we have the four ohm bridge mono test, forty hertz test tone. Let's see what she'll do at 4 ohms bridged. Two sixty seven point three. So now we're going to test the unloaded voltage output from the speaker terminals. And this is just um, from the left channel. We're going to see what the unloaded output is. This gives us an idea of how much dynamic power the amp has. Twenty six point nine eight volts RMS. Well, there you have it, folks. The test, output test of the Audio Art 2400 HO. And as with many uh, amplifiers that, um, that don't come with birth sheets to verify the claim of the output, this amp comes up a little bit short in power output. Still, that said, nice looking amp, still pretty powerful for what it is. Very nice. So there you have it, the Audio Art 2400HO. This is Big D Wiz, old school stereo.com. More tests to come. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my videos, comments, favorite, share. Embed it on your own website as far as I care. I just want more views. You guys have a good one. Big D Wiz, I'm out of here.